It's happening, guys. It's... It's really happening. Uh, it is, uh... It is 9 o'clock in the morning on my side of the... Of the, uh... Of this big blue marble. And, um... A friend of mine just got in touch with me in regards to the fact that it's happening <laughs> and I don't know if I can go back to sleep dot hack is being remastered I first heard about it via RPG site but uh, Silicon Era just pushed a uh, just pushed a uh, new uh, a, a story about it and uh, dot hack GU last recode announced as an HD remaster with new elements and systems um, I'm just gonna skim it real fast I'll, I'll put the link to the story in the description of this video so that you can go read it for yourself but GU is getting remastered guys I am I'm off the wall right now I'm off the wall. I never expected this to happen. L last night was the Sony conference, and I did not... I didn't expect it to happen. <laughs> I, I was expecting it to happen at this at the Sony conference, and it's not... It, it didn't... It didn't happen, but then this morning I wake up and it happened, and I'm like... <sighs> okay, so basically, uh, the, the gist of it is that Famitsu uh, had a... Uh, this this week's Famitsu had uh, Namco Bandai Namco uh, announced uh, Dot Hack GU Last Recode, uh, which is an HD remaster, um, and it has new elements that'll make that a cool quote make it feel like a new game, which I'm super hyped for. Um, the it's the it's part of the, the 15th anniversary of the series. Um, let's see. Da -da 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 -da. No further details were shared from the new title, but they say it won't be a single HD remaster, but a newly reborn .hack GE with enhanced graphics, systems, and elements that'll make it feel like a new game. Uh, it's in development for PS4 and PC. Uh, released, it has yet to be announced. Uh, here's a follow-up report. Um, if it's for PC, there's a good chance we're getting a Western version. So it's going to be a, a full game, uh, 1080p. Uh, high definition movies supports 60 frames per second. High definition backgrounds and UI. Uh, it adds a retry function, cheat mode, uh, movement speed increased, uh, item slot number increased to 90, item menu shortcut and sort functions added. Certain items have consecutive usage function, made easier to see empty equipment slots. Uh, Chimp sphere and virus core possession cap at 999. Um, Reduced probability of allies selling off items you give them. Improvements that were made in Volume 2 and Volume 3 will be reflected on Volume 1. Um, battle tempo increased with a rise in offensive ability and reduction in hit stop. Weapon skill up rates increased. Increase in experience points gained. Some powerful enemies have been mitigated. Skate's uh, shooting speed has been increased. Avatar battles have been rebalanced. In addition to being able to renew the marriage events in, in Volume 3 of Redemption, you'll be able to do it with all the characters that become party members. Um, all movies from the terminal disc that were bundled with a special edition of Volume 1 will be included. Haseo, with an unfamiliar look, appears. Um, yeah, so that looks to be all of the, 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 the improvements, increases, and all of that. Uh, I am so, so damn hyped for this. So hyped. Um... Just the fact that we that we are it feels like we're being acknowledged. The fans of the series have been kind of ignored over the past couple of years. Uh, it has been uh, 12 years since volume two, well, since volume one came out. I think it was in 2005 that volume one came out. It's been 12 years since it came out, uh, and we've just been kind of thrown to the wayside. And now we are getting recognition. Um, now because because it's on PC, it there's a high chance that it will be released in the West. Um, I hope that they do a re-recording of it. Um, I, I would love to get the 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 cast because the cast is more or less all still doing work, if not all of them. I'm not sure. I can't say all of them for sure because I don't know all of them. But I know for a fact the a large majority of the cast is still working. So we could possibly get a new, a new cast recording. And oh my God, <laughs> guys, we won. Operation Chaos Gate, 
uh, Operation Hey Oscar, um, hashtag bring back the world. I know that we may not have been the primary uh, mover for that, but the point is, is that the, the petition got like two, over 200 signatures, okay? That right there, all of them, all of you, all of the people who, who signed the petition, you're responsible for this. Even in some small, small way, you are you're a part of this. <laughs> everybody, even if you didn't sign the, the petition, everybody who has put their love of the series on display, you're all helping, you all help this happen. Where we won, guys. Like, I'm so hype. Anyway, so that said, I'm not going back to sleep. Uh, um, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna power it out. In any case, uh, you'll see more E3 stuff from me soon. I have recording. I'm, I'm gonna be recording uh, recaps of all the conferences um, over the next few days, and uh, they'll be late. But then again, I have a full time job, so I can't really do a whole bunch right now. Either way, I'll see y'all later. Just check out new content from me. And until next time, this has been James Hurd, signing off from Pixelation.